Hello everyone, Sigmalator here. Welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn. Let's go get this whole sword business sorted. This pouch is full, fair enough. I mean, there's really no need. You could easily wade your way through that. <laughs> oh, got a new campfire. This must be when Asan was supposed to check in. Activate that. There's so many around here I need to talk to. There's a dude over here. Who do I need to talk to? No, not going to let me interact. Fair enough. This is why. I'm a wanderer. Use my focus to look around. Yeah, that's what I've been doing. Well, I don't know what you're doing, but you are not. Ah! that would interest you all right not you then that's a campfire hmm. anything my focus could reveal oh it looks like there was a scuffle here but no body Someone dragged this on off. There should be tracks. Oh, here we are. Let's see where they went. All right, that took a while to reveal itself. Kind of hideout fort. The Shadow Carja Post. Let's hope Nassan is inside. Uh, 
Are they going to attack me or are they going to let me through? Here we go. It's got to be sneaky, that's all. So let me pick that up. That's one way to get in, I suppose. That's what you're talking about. Zach were introduced. Yeah, trouble. Ooh, that was sneaky. Alright. Can you not stop being smart? It's not very helpful for me. Simple, since you're obviously feeble. What were you doing out by the 
fork. It was a picnic with your mother. I think he's trying to hurt your feelings. Won't work. My mother loves a good picnic. Be that as it may, we're not getting anywhere. That's all right. I don't mind breaking a few of his bones. How many do you think we'll have to crack to make him squeal? Might take seven. All right. I'm taking wagers. Looks like you need Bleed before the sun! You first. May this crush up! God, will you die already? Thank you. Hey, the sun. Kindy, you've sent me. Let's get you out of here. I thought that old salt had abandoned me. Guess I owe him a slap on the back. Come on, this way. No, not that one. That one. Right, where are you going? Nice spot. Whoa. Quite a drop. Alright. Kindy, you've told me about the cause. Did you lose the shipment? No. It's hidden nearby. There's a lot of hungry people in Sunfall that will be happy to see it. Good. Now, listen. When you head back to Meridian, talk to a noble named Ravon. If you're honest with him, I think he'll help. Beg a high blood for help? But after everything you've done, I can't refuse. But for now, I'm bound for Sunfall. Be safe. You are welcome. All right, cool. So now I can head back over here. And a fast travel? No. Uh, I need fatty meat to make one. Oh, well, if we find a pig on our travels, we can make a fast travel kit. Let me grab some more stuff just in case. Oh, that's full. Don't know what the hell that was. But I'd rather not hang around and find out. What? But I tan this leather well. It'll keep. Snap more. I don't like the look of those, so I will let them. I will let them be, I think. They're like robot crocodiles. Yeah, let's not, let's not mess with them. What level am I? I don't. I think I'm 19, so I could probably could take them on. But for now, I'd rather get this mission over and done with. Give me your stuff.
Your snap was. I'll take the long way round. I've apparently discovered another campfire. I'm not being the stealthiest, but they don't seem to notice me that much. So if they're not if they're not going to bother me, I ain't going to bother them. I don't think that large I don't think you will. I claim this region now, it's mine. Alright, you've got nothing for me. But you. Yeah, I'll take that. I'll take your shards. What have you got? Thank you. this whatever it is I can't do anything with it Oh, there's someone over here to talk to, apparently. Hello, who are you? It's a bit. Don't bother me, Outlander. I don't need a mercenary. I need a miracle. Someone who can tell me who slaughtered my men. I'm a good tracker. Maybe I can help. What happened? Mass murder, that's what. Five night guards shredded like cabbage out there in the quarry. Five men murdered? How? Don't know. One was a buddy from before the liberation. We worked this quarry together as slaves for the Mad King. My friend, may he walk forever in the light, knew how to fight. Fiends who did this must have had stealth or numbers. Could machines have killed them? Don't see how. The quarry is fenced and gated, and I've never seen a glint hawk do anything like this. Anything strike you as strange or out of the ordinary? Well, let's see, uh... Oh, yeah. Chunks of corpses. Gushing blood. <sighs> Sorry. Pressure's getting to me. Not used to murder. Nah, no, nothing unusual. Well, except we've been doing a little blasting lately, and Saravad said... No, that's just stupid. You've been using explosives? Sure. To clear away bedrock and get to the good stuff, we do it for a week or so every year. But that's got nothing to do with the dead. They were... torn apart, not blown up. What exactly did Saravad say? Ah, nothing. Kept babbling about a pile of rocks out there. Said he didn't remember it from yesterday. 
I told them that this here is a quarry where we move rocks all day. So rocks getting moved ain't so surprising, lunkhead. I'll have a look around the quarry. If you think it'll help. Wasted time. Show was better last week. Alright, Brownstone level 24. Alright. I'll come back to that one when I'm a bit more ready for it. But at least we've got another mission. Right. Probably could uh, get rid of some stuff. Uh, what can I sell? Mineral parts of its enormous value. Train with merchants selling for metal shards. Um. Well, that's a point. Can I buy any of the good stuff yet? Ooh. Kaja, Nora, Silent Hunter. Awesome spark worker. Against shock and frequent hazard in the workshop. Hmm. I don't know. Ooh, I can buy this one. Alright. There we go, got a new outfit. Oh, I can buy fast travel. Let's buy a couple of those. Uh, any weapons? No, I think I'm all right for now. Oh, there we go. Got a new outfit. How far away am I away from this? Uh, screw it. Yeah, it's fast travel. We've done enough running. Hello. A man named Nissan came to see me, and we came to an arrangement. I think many in Sunfall will benefit from it. All this from a stolen sword. As they say, follow the shadow, and you'll find the flame. Hey! Look at us building bridges, helping the, the less fortunate. Okay, so we've got main mission over there. Someone over here to talk to. Yeah, let's pick up these side quests so we know they're there. Oh, you're up here. Uh, scale allows you to disable resource muskets. All right, cool. Now, uh, what's going on here? Again, that. Hello. You're Nora. I'm the mournful Naman. My apologies that we meet like this. Like this? In grief. You hold yours close, like a talisman. Wait, forgive me. You didn't come for reparations? Someone you lost to the Sunring? Uh, no. 
I know about the Red Raids, but the Karja owe me nothing. I see. Well, I could use the help of a strong-willed outlander. Then I would owe you very much indeed. These people seek to honor their loved, their lost, with their own voices. Not mouthing Karja rituals to Karja stone. But there are obstacles. And while Meridian holds its breath for any disturbance, these robes only tie my hands. Uh, what kind of obstacles? The first pilgrim is an Asaron, who seeks to visit the Shrine of Kings on the road to the city. He waits there now, forbidden to enter by an old sun priest who suffer no heathen. This Utaro lost her companion on the edge of the jewel, at a pool where snap moths gather. The shrine was built there to ward off the machines, and its effectiveness leaves much to be desired. And the Manuk would paint a mark on the sun's climb. The call to the machine spirits, I understand. They need no beckoning. Flint hawks perched there, drawn to the spires shining. So clear the machines out of two shrines and move a priest out of the other. All I can ask for is your charity and that their stories are heard. Naman, rituals and prayers can't bring back those who are lost. No, but it can help those who grieve to find themselves. It can lend them strength and hope, like a new sunrise. I didn't think your priesthood would ask outsiders for help. If only the sun would set on our pride. Until this is done, I am no sun priest. To wear a red robe was an aspiration. I aspired. Now our hoods make us blind. We whisper reconciliation, but forget how the old king's priests sang the words and blessed the killing. The killing? You mean the Red Raids? Yes. And the sacrifices that came after. Why did the priests go along with all that bloodshed? Sometimes we Karja are more concerned with what is tradition than what is right. Huh. Maybe the Karja and Nora aren't so different. You're disappointed with the Sun Priests, but you still wanted to be one? I spent my whole life looking up to the temple. My brother's voice echoing in his arches. Even he couldn't turn me away, and how he tried, in the end. He said, when we were loved, our robes were dyed in cinnabar. Now they are stained in blood. How so? Our robes are handed down to us. Most of the old priests fled rather than be seen in the glare of a new sun. And so we are left to wear their sins. For me, at least, they hang heavy. Where is your brother now? He waits for me on the trail of the sun, I hope. He spoke out against the sacrifices. For a priest to question the Sun King's will, his punishment was worst of all. You lost someone you loved, too. I'm sorry. No, not lost. When I took on these robes, I found his memory. I'll do what I can to help those in mourning. To honor their memories is to honor us all. All right. So that's him. Hunter's Lodge, another quest over there. Uh, yeah, let's talk to this person. Turn you off for now. Pick up this side quest. What are they doing? Able bodied adventurers, preferably with no friends or family, but I'm not choosy. Oi there, Outlander. Name's Vilgund. Did you come to the city looking for work? Oh, good shards. Enough to buy garb more becoming of your. Okay, stop there if you want me to hear you out. I, I only meant uh, a well-molded woman such as you. Uh, 
I heard an interesting rumor about a Banuk camp. Tame machines, the rumor said. So I, uh, I hired men to investigate. To just investigate, that's all. Those Banuk are canny, too canny. I paid up front. Well, uh, half up front. I I've had no word back. So now you're hiring someone to find the last men you hired. <laughs> They're a sunk cost. This rumor's worth more to me. So is there any more to the rumor about this camp? <laughs> the last bunch just wanted to know about the reward. <laughs> you're a smart one. This camp isn't even big enough for a name up where the snow won't thaw. They say the Banuk there live alongside machines. Peaceful as you like. Keep them, use them, sing to them. If it's true, if we learn how they do it, think how valuable that would be to all the tribes. When you say valuable, you mean they'd pay you for it. Girl, I'm not made of straw. What can you tell me about the Banuk? The Banuk women. Snow witches all. Cold eyes, cold... <clears throat> they choose to live up there in Ban Ur, in the ice. Trying to have a conversation, it's like chipping them out of the stuff. They prefer machines for company. That's why I'm putting my shards on this rumor. Then they might not want outsiders to know about this place. <laughs> Their mystic act. No care for possessions, for luxuries. Pile of slag. Those people bargain harder than the winter frost. Are you some kind of merchant? You don't seem to have any wares. Mm, more of an explorer. But you send other people to do your exploring. <clears throat> All right. More of an opportunist. Uh, girl. Nora, girl. <clears throat> Huntress. We live in a world of opportunities. Risky opportunities. But why should risk stand in the way of a lucrative prospect for the likes of me? All right. I'm more of a gambler. If I did look into your rumor... You won't need to climb up the shoulders of the world for it. It's on the edge of Banuk land, beneath the anvil of the moon. And you look like you know your way around the savage east. Uh, um, the east. If it's true they walk among machines without fear in this camp, well, you can't miss that, can you? Payment on return. I see. Alright, so we've collected all of the... That's for the Bennett camp. That's all the side quests here collected, so with that in mind, let's head to this campfire and bring this episode to a close. Where is it? Alright, you're on full, never mind. Alright. Thank you for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been sick later. This has been Horizon Zero Dawn, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.